Whether complimenting a meal, relaxing, or entertaining, cocktails and spirits can spark your dining and social experiences. Join celebrity tastemakers beyond the bar as we mix this week's liquid recipe for the sip. I'm Caitlin Monty, Beyond the Bar at American Cut, with Camille Austin, who's going to shake and stir us through this week's featured cocktail. Camille, what are we making? A one-to-one. -one. From one Juan to another, where do we begin? One ounce of Montalobos Mezcal. This is an organic mezcal, a really complex flavor profile, but elegant firewood and smoke. And it's delicious on its own. You can drink it neat. Absolutely. There's your smoke and your fire. This is a beautiful chili liqueur from Puebla. I love this because you can cook with it, you can drink it straight, mix with it. So good at a bar. Three quarters of an ounce of lemon juice, half ounce of simple syrup. Our last ingredient will be just a touch of a Mexican fernet. It's called fernet ballet. And this is made with a lot of herbaceous plants Give some hints of eucalyptus, some anise. Fill your shaker with ice. And Caitlin, I'm gonna shake this cocktail up really nicely for you. Give it your best. Fine strain this into a coupe glass. And your garnish is going to be just a lemon wheel. Cheers, Caitlin. It's beautiful, warm, and smoky looking. Looks like a little bit of fire. Smells like a whole lot of smoke, woo! Whoever made this knew how to balance all those nuances. Three different spirits and just those little bits of sweet and sour and everything in here is so easy to sip. This is great. It's delicious, isn't it? It's refreshing and warm, like a uh, Mexican iced tea. Very nice, Camille. For a one-to-one -one of your own, visit CelebrityTasteMakers.com for events, updates, and giveaways that take you beyond the bar. Until next time, I'm Caitlin Monty. Here's to you from the sit.